blame it on a physical I could blame it on your lips, your touch, your kiss You know, real traditional But your love's too original You're anything but conventional Baby, did you know that From the moment we fell in and knew we couldn't fall back Knew I'd always crawl back Cause baby, it's the everything for me Hey everyone, welcome to a new vlog. For those that are new, my name is Lelo. Well, not Lelo. My name is Khalelo Maseri. So I'm going to Lelo. So I'm so... My name is Khalelo Maseri and I do hope that you love my channel. Please check out my other videos. I vlog. I do upload on Sundays. And yeah, we... we... But yeah, today is a... Okay, It's a Wednesday and I am actually heading out to Cable Way. Uh, in my previous vlog, I was meant to go there. Well, I went there, but when we got there, we were told that they do maintenance, so we couldn't do the cableway ride. So today's the day they said they're going to be um, working in operation today. So I'm going there right now. And yeah, I actually have a an order to show you from Sheen. So we're gonna do we're gonna do a proper haul, high cable because. Because when game is it and I'm in a rush, so yeah, I just wanted to put it in the vlog so that I also remember to do it when we come back. But yeah, let's head out. I'll also show you my outfit when we're outside, okay? car ride is 300 rand excuse the thing that's in my nose it's vaseline it's 300 rand you gonna be crazy what i thought it was like 160 150 300 rand i hope my man is not gonna pay for that because that's ridiculous cable car ride there five minutes like we're swing i'm gonna surprise and i'm gonna do job i'm gonna put on a little rubia in broad like no it's i'm gonna 300 rand people pay 300 rand for this nonsense if I wasn't keeping on, it would make sense. How to be yours? How to be yours? <laughs> you know, I want a 300 rand. So, what I did is, I clicked a student card and I'm going to get a graduate. So, hopefully, that works. Hi, Seven Zilla Gal. Seven Zilla Tom Yam. I'm so scared of her. It's like I'm really scared of her. It's crazy, and this thing is like wobbling. It was wobbling. So if you sit on the other side, I can't. Oh my god! I thought she just broke down. But I'm fine now. Stay inside. I can't do suit and tie. Can't be in one room with you and stand on different sides One thing at a time, I have to learn to hide Oh my goodness, this was worth it But like, it's so scary Shem, the prices here are not bad So this is what the, the spa is called I think it's called Relax At At Oh, it hurt this cable way well. I would come here for massage, but like the fact that I have to go on the cable ride can't make the park out. Does it make sense now? <laughs> Shit just got real, things are getting intense now. 
I hear you talking about we a lot. Oh, you speak French now. Giving me the sign, so I gotta take a hit now. I hate you look like who you wanna hang right now. On the east side, ain't no one with the thing right now. You say, do I wanna watch? Do I know what time it is right now? I just ordered food now. I ordered a short rib because given the other lady was having meats and chips and it was so divine. So I ordered that and I'm also cold and I also got an appetizer. I wanted a cut again in the previous vlog when I went to Bobotelo, I had a Savannah zero percent. It was so nice. I wish I bought them today so that I can just show you and drink them. I really enjoyed it. It's like it's really good for people by look like you enjoy the taste of Savannah but you no longer wanna drink alcohol. So I wish I bought that actually because the mall is just here. I ain't got a clue, bruh. So what can I say to you? That I'm off day, had to fall back. You got everybody thinking I'm all bad. You know the truth. I was always holding you down. It's going down now. It wasn't that bad, honestly. I think it's much more scarier when you go up, you know, because it's just like, like how high can it go? But this was such a nice experience. Would I do it again? I'm not sure. I'm not scared of coming down. My issue is. I'm testing out this light that I just showed you but I'm noticing that it has a shade like behind I don't know if it's showing on footage really because I'm using a mirror let me just push it back because someone suggested that I should push it back and see how it works because that was also my issue but I'm thinking if I put put a wallpaper behind me then I'm not gonna have this shadow thing let's try to move the camera back and then see if I will have the shade or not it's probably because of this dark wall i pushed it back but i don't know if it's still showing the shade that's fine you know what let's just do the sheen haul that i said we're gonna do i couldn't do it yesterday because i got home so tired that cable car right basically it just took all the energy out of me so yeah the first up i got a wallpaper and it's in this beautiful design i don't know if you can pick it up on camera because it's quite subtle but this is how it looks and i'm also going to put the screenshot of the price in the screen i really like how it looks i like the pattern it looks so good but i'm going to so the dimensions are 45 centimeter and 500 centimeters what i'm going to do is i'm going to use this this is mainly for behind um on this wall here so that you remember the mark situation so that we just cancel that out so yeah hopefully that's it's going to be enough but i'm seeing with the diameter and the width not even the width the diameter of the roll itself 
it's a bit thick so yeah hopefully that's gonna be enough I also got this one for the kitchen the diameters are 40 not diameter the dimensions are 40 centimeter by 300 centimeters and it's this waterproof just plain white one I'm hoping it's gonna go well on the wall in the kitchen because I have like oil splashes from the cooking if you don't know if you're a new subscriber my place where I stay has a water paint so it just it's so untidy because it gets dirty quickly so this is why i purchased wallpapers so this will be the one for the kitchen and this one is oil proof i didn't buy a bigger one because i don't need it for a bigger surface Okay, and then because my order was less than 500, I was going to be charged 150 shipping, of which does not make sense to me at all. Let me see if I'm still recording. Yeah, which doesn't make sense for me at all. So I just put in a few things that accumulate to 150 so that I don't have to pay for shipping. Uh, I got this thing and I'm going to use it to like press down my wallpaper on the wall so that I don't have air bubbles. In the wallpaper and then i also got a cheesecloth this is for draining if you want to make a juice and you don't have a juicer so you just blend in your normal blender and then you put all your puree inside and then you just drain out the juice and then i also got this this is for the car it's a car interior cleaner and i'm just going to use this in the car we'll see i just saw that it's cheap and it actually fixes the issues that are in the car inside so we'll see if that works out and then i got a lamp renovation agent this is for the headlights if they're yellowing then we use this we'll see if it works i love the fact that they actually gave me um tape because yeah i think it's so that it doesn't spread onto other areas of the lamp and then i also got this king greater a chopper grater whatever but i'm gonna use this to make waffle fries and when i do make waffle fries i'll remember to show you how i made them but you can use this type of a uh, chopper let me call it a chopper because it's not a grater and there's also graters that you can use to make waffle fries but i just went with this one because it was cheaper and i don't really need it like that honestly speaking and then i also got these earrings these ones i got because i needed them for just my winter outfits and also for filming these are so cute and just for filming as well like sit downs because i only have like one pair of like chunky beautiful earrings my other pairs are like small very small and not noticeable on camera and i'm my chunky earring era and also what's this also for shooting because i only use those ones and i just feel like you know what i should just have diversity i really love these gold earrings and they look like they're gonna last very well also a pro tip if you buy jewelry from sheen always keep them in their packages they're gonna last you for years trust and believe that and don't obviously shower with them you know i have i have jewelry that i bought in like 2021 2022 and i still have and they still gold so yeah and then i also got these ones which are so cute i just like abstract rough textured earrings so these are the ones that I got. I don't particularly like the gold because it's giving cheap gold. This is like a nicer shade of gold. This is like yellower and more smoother. And this is like shiny. But it's fine. That's how they look. I really like them as well. But yeah, that's my sheen haul. Um, I just needed wallpapers to be quite honest with you and earrings. And the rest of the stuff was just to so that I don't pay shipping. And these actually arrived so quickly like they arrived in i would say a week just over a week like nine days but yeah let me just put up my wallpapers i'll show you the final product when i'm done or you will see it throughout the vlogs if i don't remember to put it right what else did i want to tell you guys my skin is breaking out like nuts because i was not doing my skincare routine at night for the past even I think three days ago consecutively but in the past two days i committed to doing it again so i don't know if you can see me my skin is like breaking out i need to go to my esthetician 
and do a very intense peel because I'm due for that. I'm due for an intense peel. So yeah, it'll definitely be in this vlog. I'm planning to go like next week. Particularly, I wanted to go tomorrow, but I want to film a haul tomorrow so that I edit it on Saturday and then it goes up on Sunday morning. But yeah, I'll see you when I see you, particularly when I go do my skin at my esthetician. <laughs> Today's a what Saturday and I'm actually out running errands. <laughs> so draining. I'm <clears throat> I'm having nuts. Um I just finished getting some fruits and just things that I needed to like refill on and yeah and veggies things like that and nuts just snacks because I'm currently on a diet. Mm. so good and i am eating very small portions if i could put it in summary so i need to have like snacks you know that i can reach out for when i'm home and stuff so yeah that's why i needed to come here besides i had also ran out of things which is crazy because i bought these things in I bought like just a little bit when was it on wednesday but they're finished i need to get some yogurts and stuff like that but yeah I, all i just want to say is that life is so expensive right now this lady sells grapes for 46 rand for, i mean 47 rand others are like 43 rand she used to sell them for like 32 i mean 33 and 25 now I think it's because it's winter and the demand yeah, the grapes is like still high whereas the supply is low so probably why she's doing that you know business is crazy also you will never understand I mean as consumers we always complain about how expensive things are but I feel like if you do run this kind of business you would under also understand why things are so expensive let me actually put my shades on because this is part of the fit and I need you guys to see it all all in its glory but yeah, I just feel like things are so expensive. But I also do understand the business side of things. You get me? Especially because where I buy things, um, she's like an independent farmer. But anyway, I have to rush to the mall. I have to go to Woolworths because I need the Tante Anna brown bread. I need, because it's high in fiber. And I also need some avocados because I know Woolworths sells avocado bag uh, in a bag for like 44, which is very reasonable. Um, she's selling avocados for like 70 rand and there's like six in a pack which is crazy business so i'm hoping even when i go to woods they haven't like inflated the prices and then after that i need to figure out what i'm going to eat today i want pizza so bad it's almost the time of the month so i want particularly i want a pizza that has bacon and mayonnaise and everything else of course but those are like my base ingredients that i'm really craving for which is crazy like how do i randomly crave a pizza that has that but i guess it's normal but I'm I'm gonna try ask them for a healthier base. If they have like a cauliflower base or gluten free base, then I think it'll make me feel so much better. Or I'm just gonna get like a really small pizza. And then after that, I need to go get my man food as well. He wants Indian food, so I'm gonna go to the masala and get him food. Um, and I also want chicken wings. So yeah, that's about it. Let's just head out. Uh, I just also shot a haul to die. And I need to go home and edit it. It's a Sunday today. I mean, it's a Saturday today. So I need to edit so that it's up for Sunday's uploads. But yeah, let's go. Get 
Ayo dah. Ayo guys. Kita yang juga bah the chicken and string, mayo and bacon watan. Yeah, chicken. Yeah, aku pada chicken and bacon small ne, and then. Now can I change the base? Kau kena change the base, maybe like something healthier. Ni nanti base dia. No, not the bread. I go to kanali. Hal na like gluten free, kanali flour. No, it's fine. It's not a normal one. Okay. Indian. Yeah, pen base. Pen. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. That's it, ne? The ladies were just like, No, I want to be happy. I want to be So sweet. I like people who are sweet. Let's go to KFC because that's going to take 15 minutes. Can I come on? Okay. Yeah, let's just go to KFC. I want chicken wings but i've recently discovered or like chicken having in kfc in in alfo in i don't know if it's that one yeah tobacco sauce or kfc or zinger wings or dunk wings let's one they do so let's just go to one of what's what i'm already tired of running these errands you know what kind of annoys me at kfc ne? is that they are not civilized this one time i went to well it was two occasions actually i went to kfc this one and the one in birds and they said they don't take apple pay and i literally was in, in the queue of which the queue yeah, is crazy business because it's always so long like it's always crazy long so now when i'm like ordering no, we don't take apple pay and i'm just like what so then I go inside, get a movie come hurry, they'll take it. So when I'm trying to pay, the lady is also confused. She's just like, uh, I guess show it try. So I try more and it's not going through. This one I don't remember if Gilevaza Apple Pay or not. But I'm in the drive through now. And I'm actually hoping that they do take Apple Pay because imagine being in this queue for nothing. That is gonna frustrate me so much. And also, what's this? He just said that I'm waiting, like, come here to get wings whilst I wait for my pizza there. Instead of like waiting for my pizza and then coming here because I'm also like tight on time. No, nothing else. That's it. Okay, next time, ne? Okay, next week. All right, thank you. See you again. Guys, I'm looking for the movie. Be real, be real. Haha, no ways. But now, you're trying to stress out because you're trying to stress out because what? Now, like in this day and age, you don't take Apple Pay. Like we can't pay with our phones. You they you they be crazy. But yeah, hopefully, I can pay with my phone. Oh, that guy's paying with his phone. Yay, that guy's paying with his phone. See, like people pay with phones. I, I'm so good with doing my nails. These nails have been on for three weeks. Monday gets are three weeks. What? Like, I'm so happy with the fact that I can do my own nails now that last. And I'm done going to a nail tech. This guy waits on you. Why am I leaving? Yeah, like, I'm just so happy, Hore. I can now do my nails and they last so long. The most important thing is to dehydrate your nails with a dehydrator and acetone or but some people say you can use a dehydrator l1 and then you should also prime your nails and also apply glue on your natural nail plus on the nail tip then cure that trust and believe it's going to last i also don't know last because it's acrylic because what i do is i don't put my nail like all the way in i put it like halfway through so that the acrylic goes onto my natural nail and onto the tip just to make that adhesion much more stronger I'm panicking because like yeah chai I need to get my pizza drive to Woolworths and then Woolworths is on like a five yeah half past four. Well, the wallpaper that I was installing the other day it's nice especially the Yago kitcheting is a mess I'm not gonna show you Yago kitcheting I wanna order another one and redo the one year kitchen 
and then the one year where I film, it, it's nice. Like the two, the two strips are nice. The two large strips, like it applies so beautifully. It's just that the first one that I applied was wrinkly and I saw in LED air bubbles because I was still learning how to do it. But the technique that I used in the film that I showed, in the clip that I showed, is the best technique ever. Like you don't get air bubbles and it's literally the best. So I'm also going to order that one again so that I can reapply in a shop. But yeah, I'm happy with the wallpaper. Finally, we sorted out the wallpaper issue. I know for those that have been watching, we've been talking about it for so long. What I need to fix my wallpaper and stuff. So I'm just happy that a shop know, you know. KFC, it's taking so long. Like, is is this? Sorry, guys. Is this not fast food? Things are just taking so long. This is so annoying. Let's go get my pizza. My pizza is smaller than I thought it would be. I'm kind of panicking because it took about 20, 20 minutes to get to the mall and to go to Woods. Let's drive. Let me actually check pajamas because I want pajamas. for winter because they are so light.
that forwards. I'm now at Masala. I don't know if they are. Oh, I think they are open because the doors were closed. Okay, I just finished ordering. <sighs> yeah, and then I'm gonna head home. It's getting a bit late, so I'm not gonna vlog it. I need to drive safely. So, yeah, I'll see you when I go to my because I want to go for my skin thingy. I want to see my esthetician and do a peel. So, I will see you Monday. Today's what did I get? So, I'll see you in two days' time. Hey guys, today's a Wednesday and I'm at New You. I'm here to do my skin and they moved so that's kind of boring so i'm looking for the place my appointment my oh appointment my appointment is at killing 12 my appointment is at 11 and i'm a bit early so yeah i'm with my brother just gonna spend the day together but yeah this is where we are at Let me just look for the space and I also need to go to the bathroom and then I'll talk to you, okay? I just finished with my skin. Let me just come closer so that you can see that's how it's currently looking so um for those that don't know i do my facials at new you and it's an aesthetic clinic so it's based in pretoria currently i think this is silverton because this is the new address but it's also not too far off from where they were based in i think the street was outside pretoria with the right something like that but yeah they have moved which is so much closer when you're coming from like pretoria cbd side but yeah, I just did my skin. Let me just finish. Let me put this away so that I can give you the most attention. I just did my skin and I did a TCA peel. And essentially, this is similar to an algae peel for those that don't know. But it's a very aggressive peel and you do shed. So my main concerns are my cheeks. I do tend to break out around my cheeks and also get dark spots. So yeah, this is why I did this peel. And this is also my second peel because I've done an algae peel before. My skin was terrible. I'll put pictures on the side so that you can see the progress. But I also wanted to film a YouTube video. So I don't know if I'm going to be too extensive with the photos on this video. But yeah, I did algae peel before and it really helped my skin so much. And now I did the TCA. This is my last aggressive peel. Because after this, I do know that my skin is going to become so much better. Um, seeing from the results that I got from the algae peel. But yeah, um, this peel, apparently I'm not supposed to be in the sun. Hence why I have shifted it, it, shifted it to doing it in June. Rather doing it in May and summer months. Because it does not want the sun. It wants you to be inside. And you know in winter, most of us are inside. But yeah. That's essentially the whole crux of this situation about my facial, where I do it and stuff like that. And I did buy a package. I don't particularly remember how much it was, but I think it was 600 Rand. And this was for four peels. So yeah, I've done the algae glutathione and I forgot the other one, the name of it. And then I did the TCA. So yeah, I did it with Grace. She's an amazing lady. I love her service. So professional. She's so, she's so nice as well. And also guys, I tried to comb my hair. I don't know if it's nice or if it's a bit tacky. But I feel like it's kind of cute. Not the best. I think it's going to look nicer with the other shades. Let's see actually. Um, these are my prescribed shades. Also this place, Banali, like so many places where you can install your hair, do your nails. And I wanted to walk around, but I'm not supposed to be in the sun and just check out a tattoo place because one day i want to complete my tattoo but yeah this is how it looks with these shades i don't know if it looks nice i'm with my brother we are gonna go somewhere to just chill out um i also want to go to men lane maybe i'm not sure maybe men lane or another mall to look for pajamas like winter pajamas and a gown i'm looking for good quality ones but i'm also on a very tight budget we'll see what we get so yeah guys i also did my nails yesterday i don't like how they look so i'm gonna change the color 
I'm improving and for the fact that these last like four weeks I'm happy okay anyway let's drive I will see you when I do pick up the camera My hair is looking so crazy. I think going forward, I should just leave it as like straight, you know. Anyway, my brother and I have decided to come get some food, and we are going to Ichiban. I'm starving. I don't know how my face looks. Hopefully, it doesn't look white. But yeah, we're just gonna get something to eat and then get some waffles at Roku Mama's. And then I'm gonna drop them off and probably go to the mall to get pajamas and a gown. decided to come to Roku Mama's so that we can have waffles and then go to Ichiban so the one that I showed you the seating was just crazy there was literally like one table and I don't think people sit there and eat just gonna have dessert and then go to Ichiban it was supposed to be the other way around but because the other Ichiban is a bit far away and we're already in this area so we just decided to come to the Roku Mama's first and then we'll go to if she wants to have some sushi, we love sushi, it's our thing, okay? But yeah, my confidence is a bit down because of my hair. I don't know, man. I don't know what's wrong with it. Like, it's so puffy. But yeah, we're just gonna have some waffles and then I'll see you later. finished having our waffles i just want to plug you on something right this hot sauce from roko mama's is so good this is the best hot sauce i've ever heard i'd have heard i'd have heard best sauce i've ever had this is so delicious like it's good on so many things i love it i don't necessarily eat hot sauce because can i have but i love this so much apparently i took a picture of it so apparently they many they 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 have a supplier but i'm gonna look for it i'm gonna hunt for it because i need the big bottle but this is so good guys get the hot sauce from roko mamas you can eat it with a burger a wrap anything it's good but yeah we're just gonna go get some sushi now we went to woods to get some drinks because we don't want to get drinks at the sushi place like it's limited but yeah we got some drinks and then with regards to buying pajamas and a gown, I think I'll just do that with you guys tomorrow. Um, yeah, I think I'll do that tomorrow. Go to the mall tomorrow because already it's like two. They wasted our time here at Roko Mama's because the service is so slow and it wasn't even full. But yeah, I'm having a nice day with my brother. You're a perfect man Got the whole world in your hands But you're still reaching out for me Ooh, wow, why you love me too? I'm nothing like you Opposite of holiness was what I was But I'm to you See my soul and could you see why? Hold my hand high, could you see why? some food of my 
my brother and I dropped him off at home and I'm gonna go I'm at the small I'm here to get basmati rice because we are usually buy it they inflated the prices so there's an Indian shop here so I'm just gonna go in and see if hopefully I'm getting I'm gonna get it for like less than 100 rand and yeah this is where I'm also gonna end the vlog thank you so much for watching I really do appreciate you watching and supporting me please ensure that you do subscribe if you did enjoy this vlog and i'll definitely see you on the next one